Our first! <laughs> How y'all feeling today? Because I feel fucking phenomenal. Hey, yo, I can't stay still this week. You know why? I'm going to show y'all why. You see these motherfuckers barking? You see these dogs barking? That means I'm motherfucking hungry always. I ain't never stopping. You thinking because you show up on a motherfucking Monday, you gonna get what you want? Hell fucking no. I will always outrule this motherfucker because I'm the baddest motherfucker in this motherfucker. Hey, yo, my alphas, you already know you got to be a bricklayer. In this motherfucking goddamn world of broken fucking dreams, you're going to be that bricklayer that's going to work every fucking day, and every day you walking, oh, there's another motherfucking broken dream right there, and I'm walking, I see another fucking broken dream right there, and if you got that dog inside you, all that shit do is feed your fucking soul. When I see that shit, oh, it's time to go harder. I don't give a fuck how tired I am. You know why? Because I see that motherfucker giving up and that inspires me. I see that motherfucker giving up and I'm like, yo, that motherfucker pussy. Fuck that motherfucker. When I get to where I'm going, I'm going to feel a thousand times better. So let me go ahead and tell y'all, when you brick laying, it's going to be a motherfucking hard ass task to do it every fucking day. Because you're going to be doing the shit that I told y'all in the past episodes. It's going to be monotonous. It's gonna get tired. You're gonna wanna be like, man, fuck this shit. I ain't seen the results that I want when I see him and I wanna see him when I want him now and I want him. In. All that, none of that shit matters. Fuck your feelings. Matter of fact, if you fucking feel like you got all these feelings going on, I man, I don't even check my feelings no more, dog. Cause I know what the fuck it is. I gotta do the motherfucking task. I gotta complete the fucking mission. No matter what the fuck it is, I gotta get my goal, baby. The motherfucking goal is the motherfucking goddamn trophy. You got to watch out for these motherfuckers. You know why? Because they're going to be calling you. They're going to be calling you to come out on Saturday, on Friday, and fucking Sunday, or whatever. Let's go see the game. Let's go smoke. Let's go drink. Let's go motherfucking do whatever the fuck it is that's going to take you away from your motherfucking goals and your dreams. Don't listen to them motherfuckers, dog. Fuck those motherfuckers, dog. Dog, if you got that dog inside you... Ain't nothing gonna take you away from your mother motherfucking dreams, dog. Fuck that shit. Ain't nothing in this motherfucking world gonna take me away from my motherfucking dreams, yo. And you should be thinking the same fucking shit. And you already know. Fuck your feelings. Your feelings will drive you away from your fucking dreams. No matter how you feel, they will always direct you, most likely 90% of the way, Away from where the fuck you want to go. If you remember last episode, we only fucking attack. We only going forward, right? You got to burn the boats to take the fucking island. You can't be worried about, well, if I feel like they're going to do this and they're going to accept me and then I talk to these people. Man, fuck that shit. Man, your only fucking goal, your only fucking goddamn shit is to stick to the fucking mission. Ain't nothing else important. Your feelings don't matter. How the fuck people see you don't matter. Ain't none of that shit matters. Only matter, the only thing that matters is what you have in here and what you have in here. And when I mean in here, it means fuck the feelings, but you already know what's in your heart. You already know what you want to do. That shit not going to fucking go left and right. Your feelings will, but your motherfucking, I want to always do this. I've always dreamed about doing those things. I, I had this fucking aspiration to be a fucking blah, 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 whatever the fuck it is. That shit never changes. The only thing that changes is I woke up this morning. I don't really want to wake up at like seven. I don't really. Feel, I don't want to work out today. I'm not feeling that. I don't want to do work. I don't want to do my homework. I don't want to. Whatever the fuck it is, that shit's gonna come out every fucking day. It's gonna pull you away from where the fuck you need to go to. Fuck that shit. Don't be a little bitch. Fuck your feelings. This is all. This goes out to all the motherfuckers that always tell themselves or someone else, I'm going to get it done tomorrow. I'm going to get it done tomorrow because I ain't got time today. 
I'm going to get it done tomorrow for whatever fucking stupid ass excuse that you got. There is no tomorrow! If you a fucking dog, you the alpha, you going to get it done today. I don't give a fuck how tired I am. I don't give a fuck what I got to move around. There is no tomorrow! There's only today! And once you understand that concept, you're going to understand, oh shit. There is no tomorrow. Because tomorrow ain't promised. You bricklaying in this motherfucker, right? You're getting tired, it's monotonous. Your feelings creeping up behind you saying, why am I doing this? I don't got the results that I want. I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting frustrated. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing anymore. I'm unhappy. Whatever, I'm, I'm, whatever the fuck you got going in your fucking head, right? How badly do you want this? Is it bad enough that you're going to fucking say, I don't want to go out on the weekends? Is it bad enough that you're going to say, I don't need to see my friends? I don't need to see my girl. I don't need to see my guy. I don't need to see. I don't need. I don't, all that shit going to get out the way. How important is it to you? Because there is no fucking tomorrow. Every time you're doing some random shit, it's going to take you away from your fucking dream. So there is no tomorrow. Remember that shit. Every time you keep on putting it off one more day and one more day and one more day. See how we're getting further away from your fucking goals? Every day until we're off the fucking screen. Till it's no longer a fucking dream. Till it's no longer a fucking task. Till now it's just, oh, I wanted to do that. And now, da, da, da. Let me tell y'all this. I've always wanted to do what I wanted to do. And I remember the job interview I had when I, wanted to, uh, when I was applying to be a server at a restaurant. And the dude who was hiring me said, oh, yeah, I got the same bachelor's that you do. That was about 20 years ago. Hmm. Well, I've been working here ever since. That shit scared the fuck out of me. I was like, yo, you've been here for 20 fucking years and you got a bachelor's? Bruh, what you been doing with your life? What the fuck? Yo, so just to put that in perspective, there is no fucking tomorrow! You do it today! It doesn't matter if you're tired. It don't matter what the fuck you feel. There is no tomorrow. Be strong on your island. You took that bitch over. Protect that shit at all costs. Yo, you got to live in your decisions. That means when you say I'm not going to do these things, that means you do those things that you're not going to do. And then when they come up, and you getting that, you getting the chance to say, you know what, I'm not gonna do that, or you gonna do that shit. And when they come up and you start doing that shit, and remember, there is no tomorrow. You are gonna be doing all these things that's gonna take you away. I can only pray for your dreams, cause them motherfuckers ain't never gonna come out. You ain't never, ever, ever gonna get your fucking dreams. You're not gonna reach your goals. When you got that dog in you, you understand. There's only a few things that you can control. And one of them things is your emotions. How you feel inside. Control that shit. How you perceive and see the world working. You got to protect your island. You took this bitch over. You got to protect it at all costs. That means you smile in the face of failure. That means when you make a decision and no one shows up, don't fucking go backwards. You go forward. You make another fucking goddamn plan to go and do this shit. And when someone doesn't show up to that shit, you go to the next fucking thing. Don't ever fucking stop. Like, the, you got to understand that the decisions that you make, they're not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy to stand on your fucking island by yourself. On this island while you just chilling alone. In this world of broken dreams, like I said. You got to remember, you got to be hard like a road warrior. I don't know if y'all know about that shit. Y'all going to have to Google that shit. The road warrior, yo. Mad Max. In this apocalyptic world of motherfucking broken dreams, you got to be the motherfucker that's cool being by himself. You got to be able to talk with yourself. Because you by yourself 24-7 anyways. It doesn't matter what support group you got. No matter what your family can do for you. It doesn't matter how much money you got. I've seen a lot of motherfuckers got plenty of money. Still got fucked up heads. So you got to be able to understand. 
You got to control your emotions, your smilings, your sighs, how you perceive your failures. Because that's when it's going to start stacking. When you start fucking compounding all your failures and when shit doesn't go right. Oh, man, today it was horrible because this happened and that happened. and this That's you putting shit together. Uh, I don't ever worry about when shit goes wrong. I don't be like, well, this happened in the morning and this happened in the afternoon. None of that shit's related. If you got a fucking thing that's happening in the morning, okay, what happened in the fucking morning. But I ain't gonna ever let what happened in the motherfucking morning predict how I feel in the afternoon or in the evening. Fuck that shit. You gotta be, it's like dealing with a bad customer. Dealing with an asshole. You gonna let that motherfucker shake your tree? You gonna let that motherfucker take you out your fucking place? Nah, fuck that shit, dog. Be your fucking G. Keep your energy. Like, don't worry about no other motherfucker, bitch-ass motherfucker taking you out your motherfucking shit. You the motherfucking alpha. You set the tone. Don't let no one else fuck your shit. This is like compounding what I just said. You got to protect your island just like you got to protect your dreams. Because motherfuckers will not know what you're trying to do. They will not see what you're trying to do. And they will not support you. Until they see at least a little bit or until you've already finished and you've already become what you wanted to be. And then when it's already done and said, then they want to hop on the bandwagon. Oh, I already knew you was going to do this shit. Blah, 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 blah. Get the fuck out of here. Yo. Protect your dreams against the haters. Protect your dreams against yourself. Protect your dreams at all costs. Protect your island. You got to be the fucking road warrior. You a warrior, dog, a Spartan. You the fucking alpha. You got that dog in you. You ain't never relenting. You gotta fucking keep on going, dog. That dog in you never stops, never gets full, never gets discouraged, never pulls away from the motherfucking task just because it ain't seen, I ain't seeing what I want when I want when I want it. Fuck all that shit. You keep on going, regardless of the fucking day-to-day progress. Because I bet you a million dollars, if you were to take a, a fucking overlay photos or a fucking, like, what is it, document every fucking day for 60 fucking days, yeah, you might not fucking be where you want to be, but from day one to day 60, it's definitely going to be a difference. When you got that dog inside you, you already know. You gonna bend this universe over and you fucking the shit out this joint like this, right? You can't really see it, but you can see me doing this, right? I ain't getting bent over by the universe. I'm bending this universe over and I'm gonna get what the fuck I want. All I see is a bunch of motherfuckers getting fucked because they ain't seeing what they want. Yo, bend this fucking universe over and fucking give it some good daddy dick and let that bitch get fucked. My alphas, you gotta remember to always show up. No matter what it is, no matter what time, how you feel, what you see, doesn't matter. Always show the fuck up. I'm always going to show up no matter what. 120% or nothing else. I don't care if it's one or 100,000 people. I'm always going to give you all of me because I got that dog in me and I ain't never stopping. I remember all the motherfucking times they told me I wasn't good enough. I wasn't tall enough. I was bald. Well, I didn't look good enough. I don't remember. I don't give a fuck all that shit. I remember how the fuck I felt. And I ain't never stopping. I remember how I felt. And I keep this shit in here burning. I remember it. I replay it, recycle, rinse, and repeat over and over and over. Because I'm tired of being a fucking loser. I hate losing. And you should too. You got to give 120% or nothing less. Because they only remember the fucking winners. No one gives a fuck about second, third, nothing else. They only fucking worship the winners. I'm going to leave y'all with this. I don't care if I'm down three touchdowns in a football game, 21 points in a basketball game. I don't give a fuck. How I show up at that moment, that's how you know who the fuck got that dog inside them. It doesn't matter what the fucking score is. I'm giving you all my effort all the time. All the time.
No matter what. Don't ever forget that shit. Like a fucking dog. I ain't never letting go. I want to give a shout out to my homie Royal D. He was always giving love to the show. And I want y'all to check out his show. It's uh, Late Nights with Royal D. They talk about real sexy ass sexual content. Adult ass shit. So if you're not into that shit. Or if you are. Check your shit out. Link in the description. Check it out.